Hey players, it's Gamer Bob here, and I'm bringing you a Modern Warfare 2 commentary. Uh, t team deathmatch on the map estate. Uh, now the reason why um, my channel has been uh, a lot of Modern Warfare 2 gameplay is uh, I'm just explain that I find it to be the best Call of Duty. Uh, it's my favorite Call of Duty, and I have the most fun playing it. Um, reason I enjoy this game so much is because well, let's start off with Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3 has some issues um, that I find uh, unenjoyable. Uh, first of all, the maps. I don't like the maps at all. Uh, they're way too small. And uh, I, I find them too fast paced. Uh, Modern Warfare 2, I find the maps to be the perfect size. Uh, right here, Estate. It's probably one of my favorite maps. Uh, probably because I, um, I do very well in this map. And uh, also the size is perfect. It's good. Uh, great map sizes for um, uh, large games such as a uh, ground war, and uh, smaller games such as um, free for all or even uh, team tactical. And uh, another reason why I find um, uh, Modern Warfare 2 to be the best Call of Duty is because I don't find uh, as many shenanigans in uh, Modern Warfare 2 as I find in uh, Let's say a Black Ops or a Modern Warfare 3. In Modern Warfare 2, uh, I don't find any spawn problems. Uh, I don't really find any uh, lagging issues that get me killed. If there's any lag issues, it's because I'm a, a bad host. Uh, not because of uh, my connection per se. It's usually the host, but um, let's say in, a, in a Modern Warfare 3, I could have a uh, four bar connection, but be like lagging all over the place, which I don't enjoy that at all. Um, usually when I play Modern Warfare 2 and I'm lagging, it's because I have like a two bar connection and the host is like from um, far away, foreign country. Uh, but uh, that covers the connection. Uh, the other one is the spawns. Uh, this comes uh, ties in with the maps issue. Uh, the spawns of Modern Warfare 2 I find to be perfect. Uh, I'm never spawning and getting shot in the back like I was in uh, Black Ops. Uh, to me, Black Ops was infamous for that. Uh, I would spawn. Same with Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3, the spawns are got awful. Well, they are got awful. Uh, I would usually spawn, get shot in the back in like two seconds, but uh, you'll see in this game, uh, I never get spawn killed. I never get uh, killed immediately after spawning. It's. It's fine. I have no complaints. Now, some of you might out there uh, be out there thinking, "What about COD 4? COD 4 is uh, fine." Well, uh, I first started getting into the Call of Duty scene uh, right after Modern Warfare 2 was released. Uh, my first uh, first-person shooter for the uh, Xbox 360 was um, Battlefield Bad Company 1, and uh, that game will always hold uh, place in my heart. A uh, special place in my heart, but um, Battlefield Bad Company One was my first first person shooter, so I didn't really, uh, I wasn't really on the Call of Duty scene uh, when Call of Duty Four came out and uh, Call of Duty Five. So uh, if I if I had played um, Call of Duty Four, that would probably be uh, my favorite Call of Duty. But uh, my one fair two is mainly because uh, like nostalgia factor, like um. Whenever I'm feeling down, I could just uh, hop on Modern Warfare 2 and uh, view some of the good memories that I've had in this game. Uh, like, let's say I'm playing Modern Warfare 3 for a couple months. Uh, I, all I have to do is uh, hop on this game, and uh, it, it's it's a lot funner. I find than uh, Modern Warfare 2, or sorry, Modern Warfare 3, and uh, Black Ops. I just I just have a much funner experience playing this game. I guess. Probably do in fact that uh, it's very nostalgic to me. Uh, I remember hopping on this game with friends when I just got it, uh, playing a variety of game modes. But I just haven't found that in Black Ops or Modern Warfare 2. And uh, the reason why uh, I play this game the most is because uh, I'm sure you're all familiar. World at War has some um, issues it needs to work out with hacking and stuff. It's kind of bogus. 
the hacking in uh, that, that game. As well as Call of Duty 4, there's been some shenanigans in that game lately. Just It just has been enjoyable. It just hasn't been enjoyable. Uh, so that pretty much covers why I think, or why Modern Warfare 2 is my favorite Call of Duty. And why um, uh, a lot of my channel has this uh, Modern Warfare 2 gameplay on it. But uh, speaking of Modern Warfare 3 and stuff, uh, I will have a Modern Warfare 3 video uh, for you guys soon. Because uh, they introduced the uh, new game mode, Infected, in the community playlist. They got rid of Drop Zone and uh, replaced it with Infected. Now I haven't I haven't played it yet, but um, what it is is uh, there's one guy. You start off the game. There's one guy, and he's a uh, we'll call him the we'll call him the uh, the Infected one, or the, we'll call him the zombie. We'll call him the zombie. So there's one zombie around. He has a knife, I believe. I believe there's three, don't quote me on this, I believe there's three different types of infected um, game modes. One, uh, there's a zombie with a uh, tactical knife, I think, and everybody else has um, a Kimbo 44 Magnums. Then I think there's um, one guy is the zombie and he's knifing and everybody else has a striker. Uh, and I think the other one is, um, let's see, there's one guy, and he's a juggernaut, he's a zombie, and everybody else has MK-46. I think that's how it works. Uh, don't quote me on that, though. I'd have to check it out again. But, um, yeah, I'm going to do an infected gameplay. It'll probably be a live commentary, uh, just so you guys can see what's up, what's going on in the new community playlist. So, um, that'll be up, and, um, every time someone says infected, I think of, uh, Halo Reach, that, uh, commentator, infected. But yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna come out with another, uh, I got, I, I also have some, uh, a lot of World at War gameplays, um, up. World at War is probably one of my, uh, favorite Call of Duties, when it is not, uh, hacked. But, um, yeah, so this gameplay is winding down here, uh, I just have a couple things, uh, gonna have another commentary out soon, it'll be, um, it'll be on World at War, uh, it'll be like a commentary about me, uh, so you guys get to know me a little bit, uh, like my life and stuff, so, and then, um, a couple videos here and there, I have all the World at War saved up on my hard drive, so, yep, hope you enjoyed the video, and, uh, See you on my next one.